darlings. Hello. I had actually planned to do an actual um, survival, wilderness living, minimal living, oh my God, what the hell is happening in the world? How do I deal with this video today? Uh, which you might need someday. Anything could happen, like a hurricane. You could, have, you could go without services for a couple of weeks um, in a natural disaster. So um, that didn't happen because I am covered head to toe. Not really head to toe. Really like just from here to here. And then from here, like there to there. With heat rash. I'm hoping that's what it is because that's what I'm treating it like. I have no other symptoms and it fits all the pictures. And um, so one of the primary things about heat rash is stay out of the heat. So I've been inside working with the brain mechanism, doing the brain things all day on an ice pack and keeping the girls cool and didn't get around to it. And I tried to spiff it up a bit, but it was like putting lipstick on shredded wheat. And please stop telling me to use a guide with my eyebrows. They are uneven because they are uneven. I don't, I don't know. I, I think I was part Cyclops in the womb and it just didn't. So I do the best I can to get dressed in the morning and um, brush my hair and teeth for you guys. But beyond that, five minutes in, I'm bored. And so more than one video, you will probably only see one eyebrow, maybe one big one, but more than likely just this one, because I like this one. This one is way down low. It's very frustrating. Now every video, you're going to notice my low eyebrow. And you know, trying to fix it up with makeup doesn't work because then you can see the makeup above one. I tried to shave one down and then it makes it made them both like pencils. It is what it is. I've got one. That's why, because I do that too often. It's only that eyebrow. I can't. I can't. That's what it is. It's an overdeveloped muscle here. Now we've solved the mystery of my wonky eyebrow and um, prickly heat. So, um, what do you guys say? Natural remedies for prickly heat. Think of something I would probably have with me besides aloe vera. I came with everything imaginable on board, but aloe vera. There was a giant aloe vera plant growing outside of the tire shop when I got my tire replaced. I was going to take a couple of arms of it because the guy said I could. Completely forgot. Um, so, one of the few medicinal plants that I did not come out with, that high pitch. sound as a sonic alarm to tell um, critters you're not welcome here but the wind moves the plant and it says a few went to Amsterdam where the hell are you man here I'm gonna move it over to this side electronic what was I saying did I have a point it's the 90s man we had C prompts in the 90s I remember DOS I can program in basic like RPG 2 Speaking of AI, so yeah, I lost my job to AI, but I rem remember when Prodigy came out and we were stoked, we programmers were stoked at the thought of actually being able to create interactive artificial intelligence. That was like the pinnacle. That was, I graduated right before Prodigy really came out. And then there was the AI game, The Leather Goddesses of Phobos. Look it up. That was, um, AI in the early stages, um, a game, like a video game, early video game, early video game, there you go, before it had digital graphics with it, and you just type, type the prompts. I mean, I think it did have, did it have digital? If it did, it was probably like Pong, little stick figures, but it was, um, it was AI erotica game, video game. I would have fled. So, what was I saying? I seriously don't know. Selling you have a rash. That's why I can't do. I can't do a video today. I got a note from my arm that says she can't come to work today. Here it is. Nothing to report today. 
accept my heat rash. It's going to be an hour long video because I can't get up to go turn off the camera and well, without a remote, it's a stun gun. I throw a rock at it. La, 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 la. I'm sorry, baby. I got to make you move. Ready? Here we go. Going down. Am I fat? I'm fat. Um, do I look fat in this fat? 